Hey everybody, uh, tonight we're looking at my 20 long open top and I'm honestly not sure what I'm looking at. I've been hearing a lot of splashing around going on over here and I've noticed that three of my chocolate zebra plecos are on the glass in the corner. Uh, you can even see one up top. This is very unusual behavior for them. They are normally in their caves and I hardly ever see anything other than a glimpse of a tail. And yet here, all four of them are out of the caves and are doing this kind of stuff. So I don't know what I'm looking at. I came over and checked them and they all have little white spots. I really wish this angelfish would actually get out of the way. Um, they all have little white spots all over them. Now, I just did a, a video about ick a few days ago. But this does not look like any ick I've ever seen before. I'm not really getting a good look at it here with the camera. Let's see if we can zoom in a little. So it has these real evenly distributed white spots all over its body. And all of them do. And I don't know where it would have come from. The only thing I've done to this tank recently was add these neons that I had in quarantine. And they all looked fine. Now I will admit I did not look at the neons with a fine tooth comb. I just looked in there after three weeks if there was ick on them. It really, you know, they would have been really, really covered in white fuzz if I had let them go for three weeks and any of these neons had ick. So when I was looking at these and looking at my plecos over here and, and, you know, scratching my head, I noticed one of these neons, I don't see it now, but one of the neons also has those little white spots all over it. So I don't know if I didn't just infect my tank, and I don't know what I infected it with. I have no idea. Um, I'm sure if I look up little white spots on my fish, I'm going to get page after page after page of treatment for ick and in fact I may actually begin treating for ick just in case um, it, it's something is definitely going on I've never seen spots on the fish before and I've never seen them behaving like this and they've probably been in this tank for almost a year now so I don't really know what that is if anybody else does and you know what those little tiny white spots like that let me see if I can get another look You can kind of see them on this one, and you can clearly see them all over that one. And then on the bottom, you can sort of see some on that one too. But that one right there is the most heavily covered. And again, this just does not look like ick to me. It could be, I suppose, but it just really doesn't look like ick. And I can't imagine those fish having ick on them without other fish in the tank also having ick, especially if they have it to that degree. Uh, I've had experience with ick before. If you've got a few fish that have ick to that degree, it's going to be on all of the fish to some degree by that point. And again, it just really to me does not look like ick. So if anybody knows what those little teeny teeny white spots that are evenly dispersed all over the surface of the fish, you know, let me know. I'll be interested to hear what you say in the comment section. So I'm off to go do some research, and I guess I will begin uh, planning to set this tank up to treat it for ick. So I look forward to videos to come, and hopefully we'll get to the bottom of this and get my fish feeling all better. So thanks for watching. Subscribe if you're not already. That way you won't miss any of the upcoming videos. And I look forward to seeing you real soon on the next one.